How's it guys? Thank you for tuning in and welcome to another installment of All Day TV Top 10. This week we'll be exploring the hidden meanings behind 10 very famous logos belonging to some of the biggest brands in the world. Before we begin, please make sure to hit that subscribe and bell button at the top of your screen and like the best things in life, it's free. If you've done so already, let's begin. First up is the tech giant Amazon. The giant online store aptly takes the name Amazon to convey its wide store directory. This is further hinted by the arrow linking the A to the Z to say that they literally have everything from A to Z, which should be able to satisfy you, right? Hence the dual meaning of the arrow being a smile. Pretty clever. Coming up next is FedEx. The shipping company's logo seems like a simple one with only its name. However, if you take a second look at the space between the E and the X, you will notice there's an arrow. It is so perfectly placed there that it's no wonder that it's said to represent speed and precision. Coming up next is Sony Veo. Veo is Sony's brand line for its laptops. The logo is not just a stylized brand name, but refers to turning analog waves into a digital form too. If you look closely, the analog waves are represented in the V and the A, while the I and the O on the other hand also refers to the 1 and the 0, which are the two very common digits used in binary code. Coming up next is the American broadcasting veteran NBC. NBC was once known as the Peacock Network when the bird was first used as its logo in 1956. The peacock has now evolved to this, with its six colored tails representing the different departments which is news, sports, entertainment, stations, networks and production. Additionally, the peacock is now depicted facing to the right to show that the television network is now looking towards the future. Halfway through the list, we have Facebook Places. Anyone remember the now defunct Facebook Places? Considered to be a direct competitor of Foursquare, all you have to do is take a closer look at the design especially the rectangle meant to represent a map on its logo. Now is it me or do the lines form the number 4? Moving on to the next logo with a hidden meaning, this time it's Picasa. Google's image editing and sharing site does not only represent a camera shutter. Oh no, its name Picasa is a wordplay on the concept that the site is a home for your photos. Casa in Spanish translates to house. Now do you see that house in the middle of that colorful shutter? The next hidden meaning comes from Beats by Dre. The logo from the famous headphone brand is pretty simple. The B is enclosed in a circle followed by the brand name. Easy right? The circle though isn't just a circle. If you look at it carefully, it actually represents a human head and the B letter form represents the brand's headphones. This gives the brand a personal element, allowing the customer to see themselves wearing the headphones. The second last hidden meaning comes from the electronic brand's logo LG. LG is recognizable worldwide and most people recognize the L and the G in the logo mark. What most people don't realize though is that those letters actually help create a face. The L makes the nose and the G makes up the rest of the face while the small dot makes up an eye. This gives the brand a more human element and makes it more inviting and approachable to consumers.
Coming up next is one of the biggest food and household product brands with a very long history with South Africa. That is, of course, Unilever. Unilever makes a ton of products and to showcase that, they made a collage out of the U and their name through a variety of icons symbolizing some of their core products. It's a fun way to show that they have their hands in a variety of areas and gives their consumers something to piece together. And then last but not least is one of the most recognizable logos in the world that is of course Apple. The Apple logo is theorized to have come from none other than the story of Adam and Eve. The apple is supposed to be the apple that Eve bit in the Garden of Eden and represents the fruits from the tree of knowledge. That wraps up our show for this week. We really hope that you liked it. If you did, please do make sure to hit the like button and hit that subscribe button. And of course, don't forget to hit the notification bell so that we can let you know for more content coming up. And do make sure to link up on all our social media platforms. We are at All Day TV. Until next time, we hope you have a blessed day. Adios.